Good morning. Welcome to Reels Kitchen, aka uh, Kitchenette, aka Small Space. I uh, just wanted to give you an idea of some of the things that I uh, prepare for lunch and dinner. This is the breakfast shake. This is for lunch sauteed mushrooms and spinach with peppers, a side of strawberry kiwi salad, and a cucumber with dill and a little hint of vinegar and fresh squeezed lime juice. You can have um, some of these crackers with some hummus, but you have to eat it together. You cannot, cannot eat it separately. She does not eat any red meat. She does not eat chicken. So I have to prepare, uh, you know, foods that accommodate to her lifestyle. She does, however, eat fish. So this is codfish and I put together some broccoli and carrots. I also made a, and these are tomatoes from my plant that I grew. So these are tomatoes with um, just a couple of um, mozzarella balls. I covered it in Italian seasoning and a little bit of uh, olive oil spray because you guys know that I do not like to use the regular olive oil. And here is a salad of blueberries and kiwi. Now you may ask, why is it that you use a lot of kiwi? Well, I don't use bananas because bananas are very high in sugar and I never exe exceed four ounces of fruit as you can see. There might be different containers but I measure everything out. Uh, kiwi is higher in potassium than what it is in, um, in the banana and the reason why I give it to her is because this particular uh, individual does work out anywhere between four to five days, sometimes seven days a week. And so she needs her potassium and um, so she doesn't cramp up or, you know, pull a muscle or feel like she's sore. And that's what the um, kiwi is for. In the shake, today's shake is banana caramel. And the reason why I'm using this is because she's out of school and she might uh, drop it. So she's, you know, um, protected when it comes to her, you know, her shake. But yeah, so this is pretty much what the meal plan is for today. I know that some people may say, man, that's a lot of food. Yes, it's a lot of food, but a lot of these foods are water-based. And so when you consume them, you don't observe them as much as the, or absorb them as much as you would if you were eating red meat, fried foods, um, you know, a lot of carbs. This is a, a high protein uh diet and so this is the reason why i fix it for her but if you want any more um ideas on how to prepare meals for your busy day and you don't have time let me know hit me up i'm always here and i'm always available all right there you have it